Butterscotch and Soda is my introduction to Little Audrey. Despite my love of novel tunes and famous studios, I just don't think I've ever seen a Little Audrey before. But this one is pretty great. The narrative is great. The animation is great. I did read a comment before I started watching it. Just very briefly, I caught some brief reviews of somebody saying that it was exceptionally racist. It's not actually as bad as that. We have some depictions of black characters with some stereotypes but they're not necessarily negative stereotypes so it isn't perfect but by no means if you compare it to other depictions of black characters at the time this was 1948 it could be significantly worse but that's just something that's worth bearing in mind not all of the characters are accurate representations they are almost bordering on caricatures but little audrey as a character is certainly a very interesting character and I'm keen to explore more of her stories. In this one she's eating a bag of candy and she wants to eat candy instead of her dinner and she goes well she's sent to her bedroom and while there strange things start to happen and she finds that she's in this scary version of Candyland and to begin with there are sweets everywhere there are Boston baked jelly beans and licorice and so many other sweet things but then things get very scary for her and she starts to feel really sick and obviously this is a byproduct of having having eaten too many sweets and it's obviously a very good lesson for younger viewers and those of us who also have a big sweet tooth and I thought it was really great fun. Little Audrey is a very likeable character, despite the fact that she's displaying a a naughty personality, if you like, having a big bag of candy instead of eating her dinner. It, it's not what good little girls are supposed to do. And I love that. Something I've mentioned before, and in fact, I mentioned it quite recently when I discussed Little Lulu, is that often, particularly back in the day, as it were, Boys were displayed in cartoons and kids shows as naughty characters. Girls were meant to be good little girls. So I like it when we have a, a female protagonist in a, a cartoon that's not stereotypical sweetness. Well, I suppose uh, Little Audrey is very, very sweet in this one because of the amount of candy she's eating. But I like the fact that we see her doing something quite naughty and then getting a lesson as the result of it. It also made me want to eat sugar, which I'm sure is... Not the intention of the cartoon, but certainly the effects of it. The animation is generally really good. The pacing is really good. For an introduction to Little Audrey, I thought she was very likeable. Most of the other characters we have in this are, as I said, bordering on caricatures of black people, which isn't great, but they're not necessarily doing anything negative. And in fact, at one point, her nanny, I assume it's her nanny, is it the housekeeper? I'm not entirely sure what role this character plays. But she is actually looking after little Audrey and being kind to her. And, well, I won't say what she offers her at the end, but you can maybe work out the direction it goes. So it's not the worst, but certainly it's not something that would be made today exactly like this, put it that way. So it's not going to appeal to everybody, but if you can at least enjoy the, the actual candy aspect and the message there and the character of little Audrey then I'd say it's worth watching and I'm really looking forward to exploring more Little Audrey's from Famous Studios. If they're anything like Butterscotch and Soda, I think I'll be in for a treat.